Hello everyone, I'm Lee Wolf. Welcome back to another new video. And today I am gonna be playing the egg hunt. Not really playing it, but showing you guys. As you guys know, I have the play of mini egg. Plus, I said I was gonna make another video when I completed the the the, the full egg hunt. So the thing is, you can't get the two nesting dolls because you can only choose one. But um, yes, I have completed the full egg hunt now. I've gotten all the eggs, which I'm happy about. I'm actually happy about that I got all the eggs. It was a little bit challenging for some, but mostly I got I got like all the eggs, which I yeah that's cool. But anyways, we're gonna go take a walk in the city because um well I'm gonna go to the farm egg, but for you got for those that don't know the farm egg will give you certain quests and then you have to complete. Once again, if you guys don't want any spoilers, you don't have to watch this video at all but the farmer will give you certain quests and then you would have to um do those quests i'm gonna get some rotten eggs because i want to show you guys something unless someone took it okay no one took the rotten egg but yeah i don't know if it's gonna work if the shards are gonna work on this server though which is weird because i do have the thing it might i think it's gonna work now since my inventory is loaded but, um, for those that don't know, if you have the potion, that's how you can collect shards. Because if you have the potion, shards will start to spawn everywhere. If you don't have the potion, then there's no way to get the zombie egg. So how you get the potions from the wizard egg. But if you already have the wizard egg and you don't have a filled potion, then you have to delete the badge of the wizard egg and the wizard egg. And then get the wizard egg again. And then you might get a second, you, you will get a potion. Now, the reason why that happened is because there's a glitch where if someone got the zombie egg, everyone's potions would just disappear. But, um, yes, now the glitch, it should be fixed. So, just, if you don't have, if you really want the zombie egg, you need to actually delete the wizard egg and get it back and then you'll get a potion. But as you guys see here, the city is opened. There is no glitch now to get into the city. I mean, there's no glitches at all. I mean, there are glitches, but there's none that I that I know that you can easily do. Like, there used to be a spawn glitch where you can launch out of the map. But, mainly, you can go anywhere to spawn. So, right here is the dodgeball egg. Now, if you start running around, it's going to shoot a random egg like that right there. So, there, yeah, boom. He, he did it instantly, but it's not going to happen instantly at all. But, um, he'll shoot an egg. And then you have to try to collect him as well. Um, if you get over like this, <laughs> come on, <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> I'm only showing you guys the new eggs, because I, I don't think I talked about th that much eggs in the beta version, but yeah, dude, okay, so I got that egg, and um, so that's the dodgeball egg, I'm not really gonna get all of the eggs in this, but um, yeah, so let's go meet the wizard, so the wizard egg is back there, and um, once again, it will give you the potion. I do have, like, a filled inventory of stuff. I have, like, two keys, six fossils. I didn't know fossils saved, actually. Because in the last thing, they didn't save. That's a slime egg. You gotta chase after it, and then it will start shooting at you as well to slow you down. But this is the wizard egg. You need to complete his quest. Now, once again, if you already have the egg and the badge, just get to say this. Oh, wait. Oh, it allows you to do it without the egg. Okay, so you don't need to delete the egg. Never mind, guys. But, um, yes. What happened was I did have to delete the egg at first to get it back to... In order to get the zombie egg. So that's how you do that. And I've already showed you guys the two dots marks. Now, there isn't that much eggs as last... As the beta. Like, the beta ones. I'm probably going to go through buy all of these eggs by the end of the... Uh, by the end of the video, though. If you want, like, a little guide... So back here is a pencil egg. If you get it, it's gonna write something. Um, so Q T Y Q Q T Y, and then if you enter it, oh, I I put the wrong thing down. Did I? B boiling. This is boiling. We enter. Wow, oh, boiled, that was supposed to be boiled. Why, I don't know why I'm sucking at this, okay. East, is it East, East, Easter, Easter. I swear, oh, okay, I thought that was gonna get, that wasn't gonna do it. But, um, yeah, 
that was his pencil wig. It should give it to you right after you. It's, it's kind of odd because the UI, I wish the UI was a little bit smaller so you can see what he's actually, what the thing is actually writing. But yeah. So that's another cool wig. Back here is where you find the boot if you guys don't realize that. There's a boot right there. And then I'm going to go show you guys a spawn for the rainbow egg back here. There are two spawns for them. There's one in, um, yeah, I'll also go to the other area as well, but I'm just showing the city and stuff. Because, yeah, this is, like, the complete egg hunt video. Last one was, like, the beta one, talking about my experiences in the beta. I will talk about my experience as well. But right here in this corner is where I run the rainbow egg spawn. Most people think it's, like, on the roof, but it is actually in the corner right here. So yeah, and most lots of eggs spawn in the garage, so that's a great place to get some eggs. I mean, honestly, everywhere is a great place to get some of the basic eggs, but yeah. Now the city, there, there used to be like a little mansion or apartment area here, but I think he has removed it. Because in the beta, when you were able to glitch over here, you were able to go through there and go get the egg. So I think I've covered most of the eggs in the city general area. Now the shards aren't spawning for unknown reason, but they look like little pink things on the ground. So you want to get a hundred of them so you can open an area just so you can get the zombie egg. And once again, you need the potion to see these shards. If you don't have a potion to see the shards, then you're not. Then you're not good. So there's two new portals. This one is actually fairly new because he just put it down here. This is a faster way to get to the arena. And yeah, there's not that much. There's not, there's no new eggs in the arena, but there is a new egg here. So um, another way without the shard counter, like it's gone now because I just reset it. But um, another way to, if you want to find out how many shards people have, zombies will start to spawn once there's like nine, 90 shards and then you can wait here, but Zombies might come after you, so you might have to attack them. But this will open right after the people get 100 shards. And if inside will be the zombie egg. Now, only one person can get the zombie egg. So, um, yes, you really don't want to start a fight. And back here is where the other spawn is for the um, egg. I can't close that. But yeah, this is the other spawn for the rainbow egg. Now, I think I went over all of the eggs, but I'm just... All of the, like, new eggs, but I'm just going to go through this real quick to make... Sure, because there's not, there's not that much new eggs in this game. Not that many. Yeah, there's, there's not that many new eggs that he's added. And, but there is the gooey egg. Once again, the gooey egg is in the city. The petrified egg in the grave. Scribbled egg in the city. Anywhere. An admin has to spawn this at the arena. A player has to spawn it in, or if you have the gun in water. You get it from randomly killing players, it'll randomly drop. You get it from that opening, so you need 100 shards. Rainbow egg, it spawns anyway. You need four people to help you with that one, and you go over here. You have to have every piece. You get this from completing the wizard's tasks. You get this from dodging it, and it has to run out of gas. And you get this from completing the egg farmer's tasks. And you have to get this from either a player, or you can buy it yourself, but it's 10k robot bucks. Now, there are, the thing I don't get about that is that there are people selling it for 200 Robux. Do not get that. You can, If you go on Twitter, you can easily find... I don't know why I'm walking like this. But anyways, if you go on Twitter, you can easily find people that will give it to you for free. So do not, do not do it. Do not pay someone Robux for it. It's a scam. Like, I don't know why people are doing it. People are also doing it for type egg. Don't do that. You're probably going to be better off if you find someone or invite someone you know so if you find someone you know then yeah sorry I had to mute my mic right there um so uh yeah I need to remember okay so that's the Eggman Egg Fiery Dragon Tabby um Four Wonders I think so bag of exception you have to collect eggs for some of reason like okay this egg is like the most egg people got, and um, yeah, I mean, do people really just join the game and only get one egg and just leave, to be honest? I, I, I feel like that's what people do. Um, dice egg, random chance, it's um, you randomly get it, hey. 
you there will be three things do you know what happens to the minute it works on new servers it works on new servers take you on bots for following me strawberry egg you get it in the fields dodgeball egg you yeah we've already went over this but it randomly spawns once that guy throws you get that guy from dodging his eggs 21 fossils in the cave Randomly can find it and randomly can find it and you have to dodge his things. So I guess I'm gonna talk about my experiences now. There are some game passes, like pieces, like I did buy some of the stuff from the farm away because the needles like I thought the needles wouldn't spawn, but it turned out they did and I bought two and you only needed one needle, so even though he says two needles. So these are each of these you can now there's only a shot you can't buy shards anymore, I guess, because most like there's no need to buy shards since Lots of them spawn everywhere as long as you have the potion now. I don't know why it isn't working for me I think it's because the wizard egg thinks I don't have the potion or I might have the potion I don't know what's going on, but also do not buy this This is only for the catapult so this increases the chance of the catapult spawning the tabby egg every time you buy this That's only if you have the catapult not that much people know this and also don't buy this because it's every one kill when you kill someone in an area. So, and if you, you have to, it's like one kill. That's the catapult. Like, how much does it cost, actually? 500, it costs a lot of Robux. I need, like, 500 more. And egg pieces and stuff. I recommend not to buy the egg pieces. If you did buy the stuff, then, I mean, the stuff is fairly easy to get. And this is my inventory. Now, my experience is now. Um, so, I was chasing after the rainbow egg and this guy came out of that portal and came out of that portal he got it first because he knew where it spawned and i did i mean there's not so much really experiences i kind of want to tell you guys because honestly i don't really i didn't really get that much i feel like i had a lot more enjoy i feel like the time then the time i enjoyed the most was the beta because that's when i got most of the eggs and when this game actually fully released it it i there wasn't that many eggs to get anymore and so pretty much i got the all of the eggs anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching this video if you stayed until the end and you want to leave a like you can do it if you want to i'll see you guys next time bye bye thank you guys so much for watching bye bye